Welcome to Common Pitfalls. Today we're going to talk about counting. So when you are working with a client, a lot of times there's a certain number of reps that you want to work with the client. And a lot of times new instructors tend to want to count at the client. So what's usually going on there is that they don't have anything else to say, so they just fill in the gaps with numbers. And I want to encourage you to not do that. If you notice yourself doing that, I want you to ask yourself the question, what else could I be saying here? Because a lot of times new instructors just don't know what to say. And that is where we really want to reach in into the bottom of our soul and start challenging ourselves to get outside of our comfort zone and be thinking about the exercise of what else needs to be said. We don't do a lot of reps in Pilates, so it's not like they're sitting there doing the same thing for five minutes. I mean, most of the time they're doing an exercise for maybe a minute or two, and that's not a long time. However, there's a lot of information that we should be imparting to our clients about the exercise, about the philosophy, educating the client about their own body, how they're doing it, corrections and form tips. All of that should be in there, not counting. So, if you find yourself counting, I want you to challenge yourself ask yourself the tough questions, and try to get the counting out of there.